you got to look at this magical frozen tree. I have never seen anything like it before. Hey guys, it is Joshua, the geocaching vlogger, and it is that time, it is that time of year for Checkpoint Minnesota. If you don't know what Checkpoint Minnesota is, it is a statewide scavenger hunt where they put these checkpoint signs all over our great state at iconic spots. You go there and you get your picture taken there and then you get points and you can redeem the points for prizes. So right now, I'm in the fair city of Minneapolis. I'm about to head out on a road trip. We're bringing some friends with us. It's gonna be a good time. Come on, let's go. I, I guess I'm not walking. Let's, let's drive. Hello from beautiful Grand Marais, Minnesota. This is the location of the very first checkpoint. We're gonna go over there and check it out. It's right next to the shores of Lake Superior. So before we go to check out the checkpoint, we're gonna have breakfast at my favorite little breakfast nook here in quaint, beautiful Grand Marais. Water Cafe. In Grand Marais. Ooh. Having some coffee, we're gonna have some food. And it's eight in the morning. We are very close to the actual checkpoint, but before we go to the checkpoint, you've got to look at this tree. This tree is completely covered in ice. What happens is the waves of the bay like crash against here and then the water freezes on this tree. You gotta look at this magical frozen tree. I have never seen anything like it before. Oh my gosh, guys. It is so beautiful. This thing is frozen, solid. Icicles all over the tree. Now that is pretty cool. Hashtag only in Minnesota. We are here, we are at the first checkpoint in Grand Marais, Minnesota. You can see it right over there. And we have some friends with us too. So let's go get our picture taken. One of the things that's really cool about this year is that each checkpoint has a Snapchat filter. We can take a Snapchat and have a filter for it. We even have a dog with us. There it is. I touched it. It's really cold. And we're gonna get our picture taken by it right now. And it's a little windy because we're right by the sea. What do you do with a drunken sailor? What do you do with a drunken sailor? What do you do with a drunken sailor? Early in the morning. What shall we do with a drunken sailor? What shall we do with a drunken sailor? What shall we do with a drunken sailor? got the checkpoint and now I've been here before and I cannot go to Artist Point, that's where this place is called, I cannot go to Artist Point without actually hiking out to Artist Point because it's beautiful, it's like another world out there. Now we're hiking to the edge of the Artist Point and it's actually not windy over here. There's Adelia. Say hi, Adelia. Hi, guys. It's beautiful, beautiful here. There's a geocache on the end of this. If you don't know what geocaching is, it's a high-tech treasure hunt where people hide containers all over the world. We found one here on Artist Point. Hey, Megan, you gotta find it. Where is it? What, what size where? is it? Is it micro? Is it regular? Peanut butter jar size. Okay, somewhere here. Yeah. Okay. Somewhere in this vicinity. Oh, cleverly disguised. I'm going in, I gotta register this guy. Let's see it, let's see it. Oh, oh mossy. Oh, it looks like it once had a hook, like maybe it hung from the tree. Yeah. Let's see if there's any good things in, oh, it's kind of frozen. <laughs> it'll, it'll open. Oh, there, there it is. There Got a, it is. I have a pen, do you need to sign it? There's no log in here. What? No. There's nothing in there. That is the saddest geocache I've ever seen. We have video proof, that's a cool cache. Yeah. It needs maintenance. It's so cool. All it, right, we'll, need to, we'll let them know. Okay, cool. Guys, thank you so much for joining us for this Checkpoint Minnesota Adventure. If this is the first time you've seen any of our videos, click that subscribe button, and we'll see you guys at the next Checkpoint. Woo! Next time.
time on the Geocaching Vlogger. We have arrived in Beaudet, Minnesota, which is literally one mile from the Canadian border. The strain is causing its own little blizzard right now. Wow. What a catch. Look at this. <laughs> All right, guys, Merry Christmas. I am here at the geocache. I'm at ground zero, so let's look around. Let's see if we can find this baby. 